guys, Michelle here, and I'm going to teach you how to make bump text. This is what bump text should look like. I don't know how laggy that is, but the text flies in and bumps into each other. So, um, first you start out with your normal text, and what you have to do is um, align the text to the left and then adjust where you want it to be back in the center if you want and then you gotta make a copy and on the top copy we're gonna get rid of text and leave bump and on the bottom copy we're gonna get rid of bump and leave text and then you can move text back over, like so. Now, we want bump to fly in and kind of bounce back a little. So what you gotta do is make the two keyframes. And on the first keyframe, you're gonna get bump out of the map. And we're gonna right click it, and you're gonna say a fast. Okay, so when you play it, it comes in fast, right? Now, here's the tricky part. I usually leave about, uh, one notch in between. Well, make three keyframes here. And in the middle keyframe, you're gonna put bump a little over back so it can bounce. So when you play, it bounces. Add to the effect, you're going to go to the generated media for the text, for bump, and you're going to zoom in on the keyframe, and um, you're going to make the triple keyframe once again, and in the middle one, you're going to switch the text to italic. Uh, I'm not sure if that's on the line. Make sure that right when that text bumps, it turns italic. So you don't want to be too late or too early. You might have to adjust it a little. Bump, bump, and there you go. Keep in mind though, that um, depending on how long your text box is, your um, text effect, the bump thing, will repeat itself once it hits this many seconds. The default is 10 seconds, so if their text is going to be there longer than 10 seconds, you should expand this to like, I don't know, 15, 20. Okay, now we're going to do the same thing with text, except um, a little later. I left some space there. So first thing you do is make two keyframes. Voila! First keyframe, move it out, out of the screen. Right click, go to um, fast, and then you make three new keyframes. And in the middle keyframe, you let it bounce back a little. When you play, bounce, bounce, bounce. Okay. Then you go to the text effects, and you're gonna do the italic thing again. This is really annoying. It's really hard to time this right. So you gotta check right when it bounces. Make sure it's italic. Okay, so when we play, bounce, 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 bounce. You can adjust the level of your bounce or um, the speed of your fly-ins. So that's pretty much it. This is a really good mint. 